How to tidy a messy house when you just don't know where to begin. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. And today we're tackling a problem we all face at some point. Tidying up a messy house when you just don't know where to begin. Trust me, I've been there. And I've got some tips and tricks that will make this overwhelming task a lot more manageable. Let's get started. First things first, let's talk about your mindset. It's easy to feel overwhelmed when your house is messy. But remember, it didn't get messy in one day, and it won't get tidy in one day either. The goal here is progress, not perfection. Take a deep breath and commit to taking it one step at a time. Next, we need a plan. Grab a notepad and make a list of all the rooms in your house. Then, prioritize them. Which room do you use the most? Which one stresses you out the most when it's messy? For example, if the kitchen is the heart of your home, put that at the top of your list. Before you dive in, gather all of your cleaning supplies. Here's what you need. Trash bags, a laundry basket, cleaning sprays, microfiber cloths, and a vacuum or a broom. Having everything ready will save you time and keep you focused. All right, now that we're prepared, let's tackle the first room on our list. We're going to use the 15 minute method. Set a timer for 15 minutes and focus on one task. Start by clearing off surfaces, countertops, tables, and so on. Throw away trash, put dirty dishes in the sink, and move items that don't belong in the kitchen to a designated spot. When the timer goes off, take a quick break if you need it. Then set the timer again and move on to the next task. This could be wiping down surfaces, loading a dishwasher, or sweeping the floor. Breaking it down into 15 minute chunks makes it less overwhelming and more manageable. Once you've tidied up the surfaces, it's time to declutter and organize. Grab that laundry basket and start filling it with items that don't belong in the room. Then find a home for each item, whether it's another room, a donation box, or the trash. As you go, remember the rule. If you haven't used it in the past six months, and it doesn't hold sentimental value, consider getting rid of it. Less clutter means less stress. With the clutter gone, it's time to clean. Dust, vacuum, mop. Do whatever you need to make the space feel fresh and inviting. Again, use that 15 minute method if it helps. And remember, you don't have to do everything in one day. Spread it out over a few days if needed. Now that your space is tidy, let's keep it that way. Spend just five to 10 minutes each day doing a quick tidy up. Put things back where they belong, wipe down surfaces, and deal with any clutter before it piles up. A little maintenance goes a long way in keeping your home looking great and reducing stress. And there you have it, a step-by-step -step guide to tidying up a messy house. I hope these tips help you as much as they've helped me. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more content like this and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I post a new video. Thanks for watching and happy tidying.